Today in our ongoing series of troubleshooting autoanalyzers, we are attempting to discern whether the problem is related to a mechanical issue or a chemical issue. The operator is experiencing no peaks when running. Everything appears to be fine. The serial communication value is fine. We've injected air into the loop and we've seen that that air goes into the cartridge. So we know that the sample is being communicated into the system, but what we don't know is why we're not getting peaks. So our recommendation is to inject a higher than normal standard than you normally would run on the system. In this case, we're running nitride and we're going to inject a 10 ppm standard in because what will happen is for sure we will see a very strong pink color. So if we have injected uh, air from the loop into the system and we know that the, that, that the probe and the sample tube and everything is coming into the cartridge and we have checked the serial communication value and we know that it is correct and we know our, our de detector is on because you can see the light of the uh, lamp. Now what we're doing is, is injecting a high standard into the cartridge and we're looking to see a physical color. If we see a physical color that, of a high standard, then we know that probably the chemistry is working fine. If when we inject a high standard, we don't see a color, then there's a possibility that we need to start making reagents. What we're trying to avoid is not have is tearing the lamp apart, tearing the photodiode apart, tearing the flow cell apart. When the problem is reagent, or vice versa, there comes the pink as you can see, or vice versa, changing reagents, changing the water, changing other aspects of the chemistry when the problem is actually the flow cell, the lamp, or the photodiode. You always want to make sure you're going in the right direction so that you solve the problem quickly and don't cause new problems in the process without solving the actual issue. Thank you very much.